you don't want to take too long in your offense. Brandon Ingram is the guy. He's only taken two shots in the fourth quarter. He's made both his free throws and just did his first bucket of the fourth. As he comes out with Nikhil, Lonzo Ball, Stephen Adams, and Zion. Difference of the game, though. Points off turnovers and also threes. 15 more three pointers made. Wow. Mm. That's a 45 point difference. You got it. Wow. And if you're Steven, if this play isn't going through you and they're using you as a screener, you have to be prepared to make Al Horford pay. Nick Hill coming out. On the offensive glass. Now, Steven trying to get it back. All of a sudden, everybody stopped. Zion working against Baisley, trying to get inside. He will. He'll, yes. He collects the little mid-range in there. That was a broken play, but Zion made the most of it. And still, why well, it's a good play, because it still was two-for-one opportunity for New Orleans coming back. Shane Gilders Alexander up against Lonzo Ball as they flatten out on a 1-4, but here comes George Hill. They fake the pick. Steven comes over. Loose stuff. Al Horford comes away with it. Second chance opportunity, George Hill taken away but fouled by Lonzo Ball. So scramble mode after the offensive rebound with 12.1 to play. And they're trying to see if there's a foul. No, it, it is, because Lonzo has his left hand in his stomach. He has his left hand in his gut. He didn't foul him up top, but he definitely fouled him down low. Yeah, the arm bar? Yes. Right there. You can see his left arm. Right arm, you're good to go. That left arm hit George Hill right in his stomach. Yeah, that going to the line to give them the lead. You don't think he's going to miss. So George Hill, and he hadn't been there much this year, but he's made the most of it. Fifth foul on Lonzo Ball. So the veteran George Hill, 34-year-old, puts OKC up by a point. So the second consecutive game, game for the Pels at home. <laughs> Different time. Right. Darius Lately, Baisley. Shane. Right, right. Baisley coming out and scoring the first 11 of the second half. Al Horford hitting a huge three. George Hill hitting a huge three and then two free throws. Mike Muscala going on the 9-0 run by himself. But it comes down to execution. Sit so down by a point. And if it's Ingram, don't think you're going to get a whistle, but he's the right guy to go to the free throw line. Nikhil Alexander Walker staying on the floor. And Lou Dort's a really aggressive defender. So that's the, that's the matchup to really pay attention to and watch. It'll be Brandon Ingram. Going up against Lou Dort. Ingram trying to lose him. It's going to be Nikhil for the win. Stays out, and that'll do it. Oklahoma City wins it by a point.